two hands, I lose the most with a raise check and tens. One thirty, lunch time. <laughs> Test the water. Heard. I got a discount. I got five dollar discount. Johnny's in the pot. Look out! Sharks in the water. Yeah, I got five k behind. I let him that water. Far away action. I'm gonna check. Big John once again the pre-flop razor. This time Nick flops the best of it. Kind of a replay of the last hand we saw. Big John. Pre-flop razor leading into people who outflopped him. Jeremy with a flush draw, he calls. Three players. I'll run it up. Now Jeremy's open-ended. Bet. Four hundo. Wow, just like the last hand we saw. Big John Bain the turn again. Up against a flush draw and a, a top pair that beats them just like last hand. Two calls. Well, Nick holds with top pair. Jeremy Rivers an eight. The traffic's a little better right now. People are staying home. Huh? The traffic's a little better right now because people are staying home. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Yeah, Bet. That's unfortunately. Six fifty. So I flew in this hammock. Wow, six fifty from Big John. Kind of a blockish bet. I mean, you would think Nick's not going to like it, but he's going to call with top pair. Did you wear a mask? No, I did. I mean, I sat first class and I sat in the very front, and there I, my feet next to me was really squiggly. So it was kind of nice. And then they have to do regulations now. Nick does call. As it turns out, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, that's good. Jeremy raises with fives, gets four callers. Ebony is best with nines, even though it's not a very good flop for her. Nine's still good. Jeremy senses something. Gets the best hand to fold. I feel like this should actually work. But wow, look at this. Francisco not buying it. Jeremy sends something and Francisco sends something too. Says, I don't think you're that strong. Makes it 900 with A7 off. And Jeremy makes the call, pocket fives. River's a queen, five's still good. Francisco counting out a hefty amount of white chips. We've seen him do this before, make these unorthodox plays that makes him so dangerous, and this is one of them. 
1800 on the river. Jeremy with pocket fives facing down a jack queen king board. This would be an amazing call. You're hoping he has something like a flush draw, which is the only legitimate hand you could beat on the river. We could see he had an absolute nothing that he raised on the turn. You still beat that. You beat 4-5, but you have two fives in your hand. A hand like Queen-10 just made a pair that beats you. Wow, he makes the call. An unbelievable call. Pocket fives. That's got to be the hand of the show so far. Shocking. <laughs> We got to open both the doors. Yeah. <laughs> my mom always asks me, where is your confident coming from? I don't know, from my inside. Why? Yeah. I love that though, because especially especially as women, like. In the poker world, too. Yeah. Think about one Asia little girl come from Asia, Taiwan. Francisco and Julie both with top pair. Johnny, <laughs> middle pair and straight draw. You're still doing good, but go on. Uh, if you are not confident in yourself, you check. cannot survive anywhere. Yeah. You know how hard to survive in the United States? It's really hard, to be honest. You know that, right? No, I don't. Okay. Because I'm from here, well, and I'm just used to it. Now Francisco and Julie. Oh, excuse me. Francisco has a straight flush. Are you kidding me? Julie, with a king, has a straight. Johnny, with two pair. Julie bets it hard, 600. And Francisco, with a straight flush. Now, we saw him bluff huge against Jeremy earlier. Does he want to make a big bet and make it look like a bluff? Like that one. There it is, 3,700, 3,100 more, a giant raise. And just like I said earlier, this is what makes Francisco so dangerous. Francisco is capable of doing this with so many hands, and you're sitting there with a king high straight. Tornadoes, apparently. Tornadoes, yeah. Witches. Odo. Francisco check called on the flop and went checked around on the turn. Check raise on the river. There's like farms everywhere. Southwest Florida, Fort Myers. There's like a. All right, chat. One for call, two for fold. What is Julie gonna do? I really can't tell. Even in my in my hometown, like you can do okay making like four or five k a month. Like you live pretty well. And if you're on the outskirts of town, you're like rich. I got yeah. 40, so. 47. No, 47. Less than 5K. You have a club? Hmm? You have a club? Do I have a club? Jimmy, if you tell us that uh, you have seen a song on the poker call, I will get you a two days. <coughs> Do that one more time. That was really good. <laughs> <laughs> I see. I, I see mostly twos. I think some ones though. And you get email all the time. And then Kitty will be your video girl. I'm the river girl. Do that. 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 So is this like most of the poker games you find yourself in? No, it's very interesting. <laughs> very, 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 very entertaining. It's very entertaining. She does fold. 
Good fold. I'm not a clubber, but I love dancing. And if you're Francisco, you're really annoyed because your giant bet got called when you were bluffing and they folded when you had it. I went back after living here for a couple of years and I went home and every, there's a lot of people are overweight. Jeremy with aces. Nick had calling chips out before Jeremy even uh, raised. So 275. Nick's in there too. Francisco flops a pair. Big John with a gut shot. Aces are still best. Now remember, Francisco tried to bluff Jeremy earlier. I'm sure they're both thinking about that hand right now. Five on the turn. Check, check on the turn. Aces holds. Nine hundred on the river. It smells of value as far as the sizing goes. Francisco makes the call. Jeremy's going to show the winner. Two hundred from Kitty first to act. Big John with the same hand calls. From Big John. You got 15 year old son. Kitty kind of going to I check call a, mode with Ace King. Be 19 in two weeks. So I've got she does have a diamond. How many kids you have? Two. Well, there's one. They're both in all. Yeah. I'm like panicking. Yeah. Bring I thought in, I would yeah, panic. Yeah. Get, I did panic here, last man. year when she turned 18, check. but now it's like every year. I'm just yeah? like, oh. Wow. And they both <laughs> river a straight. Look at that. Soon, 18 and 21. Done and done. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. <laughs> Done-ish. Done-ish. If you're a kitty, you're loving the hand because yeah. you only lose to a flush and you would think now that she's older. She tried Big John to, would uh, bet his flush on the turn. But she, um, kitty basically sets Big John in and Big John insta calls. <laughs> and she didn't know until she got there that she had to pay rent. <laughs> How can one concentrate? Wait a minute, who's the teacher here? <laughs> Jeremy flops bottom set. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's fun. <laughs> Guido with a pair of sevens and a gut shot. Thank you. This is the second set for Jeremy. Had one earlier against Nick. Just a call from Jeremy. I focused on wine, so I didn't know if you know I was going to lay out. <laughs> Can you get service here too? When you have the, the M6. Wow. Five on the turn. Guido hits the gut shot that he needed. <laughs> the Camus is good. Camus. Uh, and remember, Guido was the pre-flop raiser. How often are you going to show up with a seven here? It's really good. Opus one. Oh, Opus is good. Yeah. If you're Jeremy, you don't necessarily hate it. Which is actually 
pretty good for, for yeah. The pricing is pretty good. It depends what year is. Eight seventy five from Guido. Ready I mean, if you're not, I'd, I'm, I'm ready. I don't go. Force you into it, okay. Um, <laughs> so I'm like that lady with the frog. Yeah, I'm like, but she's sure, like, okay, yeah, go, go ahead and tell me if yeah. you want. So she takes. So he explains. You know, he likes. Call from Jeremy in a brick river. Could be very expensive. But look at this river is a four. Jeremy makes quads. Unbelievable. They are both. Guido and Jeremy both love their hand right now. And Jeremy, sitting with quads, gets twelve hundred bet into him on the river. <laughs> Jeremy's still very deep. Guido with about 4,500 behind. How much do you want to raise here? I don't think Jeremy puts Guido on a straight here as he is the pre-flop raiser. You put him more in a hand like an overpair. Ask yourself how much would an overpair call. 3,600. So she's, she takes her robe off, she gets on the bed, she puts the frog down, she positions herself right in front, she spreads her leg, she pulls her thing up so it's right there, and the frog, again, just staring at her. And so the guy goes, son of a bitch, he goes, I'm going to show you this. Back on Guido. <laughs> <laughs> I knew that's where it was You knew going. it was going there, yeah. Well, thanks for letting me get there, coach. You don't like the <laughs> raise. Suddenly... Every good Jeremy's hand yeah, looks yeah, an yeah, awful yeah, lot yeah, like a set, not necessarily <laughs> quads, but a set, full house. That's so, that's fantastic, actually. Yeah. And you know, it's, I have a death leaf here. Calls the 200 pre-flop, calls a bet on the flop. It's going to take me a second, Jeremy. So I was like visualizing. Calls, like only calls a turn because there's a one liner to a straight and builds up on the river. That's what I would be most worried about if I were Guido. Are we going to replicate this joke that you just told me? Well, I think that's a good way to start because get, what's more scary than that if you're here? afraid of frogs? <laughs> we want it colder. colder yeah, colder. Yeah, It'll never back. happen, but yeah. we always ask. Yeah. It's maybe it's, you know, it's day they'll start. 2,400 more? She's uh, never going to give them a message. No, she's going right up right here. 2,400 more. She's like, uh, <clears throat> Smells yeah. like value, Jeremy. <laughs> uh, I thought you should have raised me before, though. Well... Sometimes you just get cooler. I guess I got cooler. Nice hand. Calling? He's calling you. Guido makes the call. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Nice hand. Lucky. Another huge hand for Jeremy. It's kind of been his day so far. Nice hand. 100 from Johnny. Three callers. And look at this, Julie flops, middle set. Johnny with top pair, ace queen. I believe you're ahead. I don't want to believe you're ahead. This could be a huge it hand <laughs> for Julie. <laughs> she doesn't watch? Four hundred, pretty big bet. And Julia says, "How much?" Francisco with a gut shot, he calls. They all check, but they can't Two call. quick calls. That's, that's, that's bad news. <laughs> yeah. Now Francisco's double gutted. Check to Julie with a set. Yeah. Casually throws out 1,000. Okay. Wow. Look at this. Johnny says, okay, throws out 4,000. I mean, if you're Julie, you lose to pocket aces, and that's it. I realized a long time ago what people think of me is none of my fucking business. So. <laughs> You'll go insane if you care what people are. No, I don't care. Not keep my emotion. All in. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> All in a quick call, and Julie's worried about pocket aces, but she's already won the hand. She has the check mark already. Whatever he wants. No, no, I'm dead. Do. Yeah. One time. I'm dead. <laughs> good. Three threes. Three nines. Good. And just like that. I need some more chips, I guess. <laughs> Julie Feltz, the legendary Johnny Chan. Oh, man. There's 500 more. Thank you. 2,500. Uh, yeah, I'll straddle. Sorry. I want to pull so it's <laughs> Looks like Johnny limped in, limped in with Jax. Guido on his left hit at 175. He's for a club, a couple calls. We raised to 2,000 straight. And now 2,000 from Johnny, who just got stacked. Johnny now. now makes it 2,000. Johnny is here. He has 7,500 behind. Yeah, back on Guido, who ra who's the initial raiser. I mean, I would, I've got to imagine this is, this 2,000 is going to get through. I don't know. We never, we, you don't know what I have. <laughs> I know what you're representing. <laughs> Kitty, it's all so good. Thank you. Yeah, exactly. Kitty, uh, you have another glass? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we're done with this. One winner and lose one. Good race. All right. And they don't waste the first one. They didn't waste the first one. Huh? Yeah. I don't know anything. You took a sip? Without us? Wait, no. Oh. I want to taste. No. Can you bring two more, two more glasses? I did yeah, not. Yeah. Cool, 75. Fucking damn. I did? Yeah. No, the people. We almost had a thing. Shit. Oh, excuse me. I forgot. Very sorry. Is that a, a, a razor straddle? It's a race. Nobody saw this. Nah. Oh, shit. Well, where are they? I don't know. Nobody saw it. I'll tell you. I'll text you. Hmm? It's a razor oh. from, uh, from yeah. Judy and 350 for Wow. Reagan, the Reagan was in office the last time she did that. Holy <laughs> shit. <laughs> it was further back than that. <laughs> yeah. My back was bored. Her first client. Yeah. Let my hair wow, down. Wow, action yeah. hand. <laughs> Ebony three bets with ace, king of hearts. Johnny flats with queens. <laughs> Julie hangs around with deuces. And Johnny pretty much smashes the flop. Ace, king, jack. Really bad flop. Oh, excuse me. Ebony smashes the flop. Really bad flop for Johnny. But Ebony bets really small. Well, about a third size pot, 400. And Johnny turns a set. Also brings a one-liner to a straight. Check, check. Now the fourth diamond. No one has a diamond. Looks like Ebony is counting out a bet here. 900. Quick call from Johnny. Johnny's going to win with a set of queens. Oh, shit. I was, I'm used to winning. <laughs> <laughs> or someone letting her take it back. Still winning. Either way. Yeah. I'm uh, 15 nice behind. Okay. 1,500? Yeah. Whatever they want. We're the good side. 250. Yeah. 250. So Strato is on. Right? We're the really good side. Yeah, yeah. Now you can say that, and we're drinking. How's that feel? Peer pressure is real. She came here to fuck you guys up today. <laughs> I mean, 250 from Johnny. Never, 
Let's see. Yeah. It's pre-flop. How am I doing? <laughs> That's my pre-flop skills. 250, five ways. <laughs> Look at this. Johnny oh. getting, uh, playing a little funny hand here with 7-4. Flops bottom two pair. Yeah, please. And he leads out huge, fourteen hundred. And Julie, who stacked him earlier with king queen, she says I can't fold and calls. Johnny's ahead right now, but his hand's very vulnerable to bottom two pair. Seven on the turn. That gives Julie a flush draw. A club here could be disastrous for Julie. King on the river, top two pair now for Julie. 4,000 from Johnny. Quick call. And just like that, out of the blue, Johnny raising 7 4 from early position. 4 7, raise the. Right? Johnny fucking Chan goes Toto, and then Johnny fucking Chan goes Toto. Kind of gets revenge for the hand that he lost to Julie earlier. Yeah, you don't understand that, but that's what you're saying. What I saw was a winner. <laughs> Three seventy-five. The game has passed them up. Okay, now we. <laughs> what are you guys talking about? Yeah, but if you flop seven-four, you're good, man. So I don't care how passed well, up it is, man. You're, you're good. <laughs> 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 they flop a full house here. It was well disguised. I couldn't put them on. Can you call for uh, uh, what is it called? Service? Yeah. I think the air did come on. So? Thank you. I did cool. Well, I'm a little buzzed, but it's three players. If anyone's ready to take it's advantage of me, now would be the time. Now. now. Now's the time. Three weeks ago. <laughs> <laughs> would, be, would have been the time. 500. Do you, they know we have seat open? No. Hey, Francisco. Yeah. <laughs> what are you in a rush? Hey, Hannah, Hannah better. JJ. 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 Yeah, I wish smart were pro. We are in <laughs> no seat open. Just take the seat away. Just bring the that team. seat into the pit. Call up David Cullion. You know yeah. Watch I don't care if he watches the stream. We know that. <laughs> he gets so mad too when you say stuff like that. But he should. JJ, we don't want you. JJ, here. we, we <laughs> don't want you. Take it as a compliment. It is a take compliment. Take it any way you want to take it. Okay. Do you want me? I I like you, JJ. In which way? I'm a great at this camera. No. And this one. No. And this one. <laughs> and this one. I like you, JJ. No. Bye. <laughs> At least I'm funny, right? Yeah, it's okay. You're funny. Yeah. I catch about half of what you say, and it's funny. No, I have a. Where? I'll throw it. Locked up. Lock up. No see open. Yep. Invisible man. Anyone see I see? Oh, I'm taking this guy. Yeah, take this shit. And I am back. Looks like I came back in just the right time. <laughs> with some champagne. Yeah, nah. Guido all in with top set. Big John thinking about it. Open ended. No, 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 no. Jeremy Goodbye. also open-ended. He bet. Guido shoved all in. Now it's like literally on my list. Like I'm like, okay, I have to try this now. Now it's on Big John. I'm like, you never drink cheap wine to begin with. It's fine. Yeah, but you can tell me. Come on. I'm going to live a single life with no wine. Expensive, 275 a day, you know? Say again? It's expensive, 275 a day. Yeah, but you always can find somebody to buy you something. Yeah. Big John might be thinking, does he want to gamble here? Just pretend like you're getting interested. If I win this, I'm unstuck. No, the beauty of it is she doesn't have to pretend like she's interested. She could just be like, buy me wine. And he goes for it. The angry if I don't drink. You look better when I drink. Yeah, you. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, if he wins this, 
I think he'll still be stuck. I already got something big. I don't know what I don't know what that means, but you drawing? Want to open? Okay. Twice. Twice. Well, looks like they run it twice. Oof. Jeremy would have won that one. Oh, excuse me. No, he would not. Guido wins the first one. That's me. And Guido's gonna win the second one. Even with Big John making the straight on the second one. <laughs> Now Ebony with Kings. Kitty getting out of line. Three betting. Really and six, seven at clubs. She's probably thinking, like, what bad luck the one straight. time. She, uh, she's just like, I raise light. Stuff, like, I get like, four bet immediately. Save me some money. Save me at least taking a big hit in this time. But she calls. lost like 8% of his net worth. Oh, he went from like 118 to 110. Overnight, that's gotta fucking hurt. Yeah, that's gotta hurt. I mean, yeah. It doesn't matter how rich he got outdrawn. I mean, I mean, it hurts. But well, nothing there much. You still wake up and you have 110 for Kitty. So. I'll go bet so. in a fold. I don't, I don't think that's how people think, no matter how rich you are. Uh, I mean, I, uh, I, what I, do you I, think, Nick? You I think it's somewhere in the middle. You, know, you have 118 I billion. Right. You have 110 you billion. Have but no. Look at this. Kitty's gonna float here. Eleven nine hundred and a call. You would never guess Kitty would have six seven of clubs here. Queen on the turn does nothing. Kitty officially drawing dead. Now a check from Ebony. And you would think Kitty's gonna bet here. No, she checks it back. If they took all the money away from Ebony checks again. Yeah, you would think. Kitty called the flop to bet at some point. Wow, and before, before Kitty finishes counting out the, or putting out her chips, Kitty snaps in the, or excuse me, Ebony snaps in the call. Thank you. Oh, Kitty. <laughs> Nine hundred. That's, that's some pre-flop right there. Oh my God. It's so dirty. No, you wish, I'm cleanest guy you know. <laughs> Nine? Yes, sir. They actually say cash as you do. More ace king. This time it's Nick and Emily Literally both with the same hand. The and they're both yeah. super, 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 super deep. Everyone's gambling, coughing, touching their face. Guys Nick the three bet. <laughs> Ebony four bet. <laughs> I mean, the gym, what's, uh, Ebony does have position. Gym, right? yes. Way worse. This place is the worst. I think. I'm not kidding. Oh, oh. People are smokers here. There's a lot of people there. Neither with a pair now. Yeah, but if you're a healthy person, or, I mean, what are, what are your odds of catching if you're a healthy person? Emily could still win with diamonds. Still, like, same. same, really? Even if you have a strong immune system? Yeah, you might not become symptomatic if you beat it. 700, a quick likely. call from Nick. But you're still going to carry it and pass it on to them. Check. That's why they say kids, thank God the blessing Jack on the turn. So it's only people over 60, correct? That's what I read. Deuce on the river. This goes check, check. They're going to chop it. Sixteen hundred from Nick. Trying to get the same hand to fold or a hand like pocket tens, I'd imagine. But would you four bet that? Gets through. Tell me later. She had ace king. Gets, Nick gets Ebony to fold the same hand. Really? We didn't oh. ask what I had. We asked what you had. I didn't ask. I just think we were guessing. It opens 100. It's three callers. And Francisco. Trip nines. Julie with the overpair. That's not the right thing. And look how easily JJ folds the eights there correctly. Oh, he wants a barbecue pork. combination on the Asian menu, right? Francisco playing the tricky, trappy game. <laughs> check calls, flop, not checks, turn, but gets checked through. Yeah, not the pork buns. Yeah. Like, how long is it going to take, you think? Uh, I have a few 
And look at that. He reached for chips like he wanted to bet. And then balked and then check. Got what he wanted. 500 from Julie. And now he's going to raise. It's just a matter of how much. All in. Hey, Joe. Hey, Joe. What's up? What's up, Joe? Yeah. Yeah. Next week. Yeah, I'm trying to be so fucking good. I'm just so finished, dude. I've been there. No. So tilted, though. Why? Why? Like an hour and a half ago. So, friend? Looks like 2,800, 2,300 to call. Pretty annoying for Julie. You tried to play it safe because you know how tricky Francisco can be, and then you end up getting check raised all in anyway on the river. So far, out of this, these scenarios. Francisco has bluffed. Yeah. He got called on his bluff. Julie folded when Francisco had it. Yeah, cooking lamb is sort of unfor overcooking lamb is almost unforgivable. It's very overdone. Can she make the fold yeah. again? No, this time Francisco gets paid. How much money? 